SketchUp is freezing. Layers are not working and it takes ages to model new objects. Maybe you are making mistakes that can slow your work down in SketchUp. Today, I will tell you about five most common mistakes in SketchUp. Let's begin. Monica from EDAC. Today I will tell you about five most common mistakes in SketchUp. 1. Modeled elements are not grouped together. When we are modeling in SketchUp, we often forget about the most important thing that will speed up our work. This is creating groups. When the model is created, for example a table, remember to group it just after modeling. I click three times with the left mouse button so that it's completely selected and then I click with the right mouse button and choose Make Group. When the objects are not grouped, we can notice that the newly created elements are connected to each other. If you want to separate them, unfortunately, we need to model them again. Number two, problem with tags. It's very important to assign models to the right tags. Individual objects should be assigned to the created texts or layers. Thanks to this, we can hide or show specific groups of objects. When we are modeling, we should keep the active tag intact. Then after grouping, we can assign it to created tags. Number three, importing heavy and broken models from 3D Warehouse. When working on a project, we often import models from the 3D Warehouse library. Let's pay attention to the quality of the downloaded models. They may turn out to be too heavy or simply badly modeled. This can slow down your work or overwhelm the project. Let's check the most important information about the downloaded model, including the file size or the number of layers. Number four, unused elements. If you notice that your project runs slower or freezes frequently, it may be caused by a heavy file. To reduce this file size, go to the Window tab, Model Info, and Statistics. There is a button, Purge Unused. Thanks to this, you can get rid of unused content. It's a very useful feature. We don't have to worry that the elements that are in the scene will be deleted. As you can see, after removing unused elements, the file is much lighter. Now the SketchUp will definitely run faster. Number five, circles are not smooth. I've seen a lot of projects and visualization with one common mistake. Created circles were not smooth. This is connected with the number of sides that create a circle. In the lower right corner, there is information about the number of sides. They are 24 by default. We can always change that. Just click on the circle tool and then type on the keyboard the number of sides forming a circle. It can be, for example, 70. As you can see, it looks much better now. We can also create a circle with 24 sides. Then, after selecting in, go to the Entity Info window. There, we can set the number of sides that create the circle or change its radius. There are probably even more things we should avoid while working in SketchUp. If you know any of them, just write in the comments below. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Check out my website edac.org with more SketchUp courses. See you soon. Bye.